Hey everybody, and welcome to my N5 series on the SP404 Mark II, where I cover a topic in about five minutes. This is just a demonstration of an issue that I have found using the MPC sequencer on the SP404 Mark II. I haven't quite figured out which one is the problem yet, although I suspect it's the could be the MPC, might be the SP404 Mark II. But let me show you what I've been doing. So I've been triggering the SP404 Mark II. So I'm hitting the pads through MIDI. It's sending a signal from the MPC over to the SP404 Mark II. If I sequence it, I wanna show you. So you're, you heard me play that pattern. You can see there's supposed to be a kick here and it's skipping it. Now, I have gone through all of the settings over here in the system under MIDI, I haven't actually found anything that seems like it would trigger it or tell it or cause it to not trigger. Um, I do suspect it is an aftertouch issue because watch this. Go erase and we go to automation. And if I just say, you can't even select anything else. You just say all. If, you, if I hit play now, it's gone. And I want to show you, we'll just do it again. I'm just going to re-record it. That was probably a little bit off. Eh, whatever. It's good enough. You can still see. I just recorded it, and it's skipping that note again. Now, if I come up here and go into automation, we've got velocity. Probability is 100%, so it should be triggering all the time. And like, the aftertouch, for whatever reason, is really low. So, I mean, we could probably come in, just hold it down max. And you see it's still skipping it, and it didn't draw in that first, like, beat. Uh, so I don't really quite understand what's going on. But again, if I come over and say erase, just do automation, it's now triggering fine. Um, the other piece that I've been playing around with, which is, makes this more interesting to me, is... So we'll just trigger this. If I hold down menu, hit the pad to go into step sequencer, we can just come in. Let's just remove these steps. If I just put them in, you can see it's playing fine. And if I go back into the grid view and go look at automation, we just go to look here. There's no after touch. Now, this is all fine, I guess. Um, except that it's just not working, which is a little frustrating. But if I go back in here and record this one more time, we've now got the aftertouch added in again for the track. You can see it's in here, and it's not playing correctly. I cannot come in with the pencil. Oh, wait, now I can. That's weird. So apparently the aftertouch is the problem. Well, let's just draw in a whole bunch. I don't understand. Well, anyway, guys, I'm going to keep playing with this, but I just want to point out if any of you are having problems using the MPC trying to sequence your SP404 Mark II for whatever reason, it seems like the MPC has some sort of uh, unfortunate problem. And I'm going to have to try and use it to sequence other things to see if it's just... SP404 Mark II related, or if it has something to do with the MPC itself. Anyway, guys, thanks for stopping by. Keep making music. Keep having fun. Remember, if it sounds good, it is good. And peace.